disease investigation at Columbus Public Health. If you are a healthcare provider calling to report disease other than COVID, please press 1. If you are a healthcare provider calling about COVID, please press 2. If you have medical questions regarding symptoms of illness and testing related to COVID, please press 3. You have... Columbus Public Health. How can I do Hi there. I have I have a question about COVID. Can you help me out? Yes, hi. Sorry. So all of my friends on social media are telling me to not go outside my house and to not um you know, do things like go to Top Golf or go to uh a restaurant to eat. Is that something that I should be doing right now? Um where are you calling from, first of all? Oh, I'm just I, I, I live in Columbus, Ohio, and I'm perfectly normal and healthy. And um, some of my friends are telling me that to stay inside my house, to don't go outside, and and that um, to, to go out to the restaurant or something like that. Yeah, they tell me don't go to a restaurant, um, don't do anything, don't go into stores. Um, you know, it, that that it's irresponsible if I if I go outside and and do those things. Is that is that true? Um, actually, no. I mean, people do go out, you know, every day. If you want to go out to lunch or something, you know, dinner, yes, you can, you know. But oh, what we are advising people is that if you're feeling sick or something like that, you just need to stay in the... No, I feel perfectly healthy, and I have lots of energy, and um, I feel great. But is it selfish of me to go to a restaurant right now? No. So you told me that you're not feeling here, right? You're healthy, right? Yeah, cause I'm very healthy. I worked okay. all day yesterday. I don't feel okay. bad at all. You just you know do whatever you want to do. Um, but if you start feeling somehow, you just need to stay indoor and self monitor yourself and you know self quarantine yourself. What what would what what would, uh, okay, so the symptoms, that, the symptoms that you're gonna be looking for is your eye temperature if it is above one hundred point four, and yeah. um, chills, and also uh, cough or shortness of breath. Yeah, so if I feel shortness of breath, like I can't breathe, or one hundred and four temp, or chills and cough, you're saying I should stay inside, right? Yes. But if, but if I don't, in, but if I if don't you, feel those things at all. Yeah. Yeah, if you don't feel any other symptoms, like let's say like flu-like symptoms, if you don't, then you're okay. Then I'm okay to to what to to go outside and to yeah go to restaurants and to local businesses. Yes. And then, but what if but what if that affects in some way? Does that affect the lives of other people who might be immunocompromised, or affect the lives of elderly people who might die from the corona? Yet. Your body's living with you. It it does affect their lives if I go outside. No, because if we we advise people that just come from let's say you just come from China or you just come from um, a state that is high cases, let's say New York or something like that, we tell them to stay indoors for for at least fourteen days to see okay, if they have. Okay, so if you have days. traveled from New York or something or from China, then you you're telling people that they should stay indoors for ten days. 14 days. Okay, it's whether they have symptoms or not, you're telling them to stay then indoors. Then if they start having symptoms during that time, if they have started having symptoms, such as, um, like I said, the coughing or the um, uh, fever or something like that, then you call your doctor. You tell your doctor, this is how I'm feeling. Maybe the doctor will have, will have to, you know, assess you and be checked before you can be um, tested. But if you don't, but if you haven't been from New York or China or have a fever, cough, chills, um, or shortness of breath, you can't breathe, if you don't have any of those things going on, are you supposed to stay inside of your home and not go outside? No, you can. Okay. You can, yeah. You can go out if you don't have all that. And you do indoor for at least 14 days. Yes, you can go out. Okay. Well, okay. okay, well, that's good to know. Thank you so much for answering right. my questions here. You're welcome. You take care, okay? All right, you too. All right, bye. Bye-bye.